This is how you'll most likely find Titans fans right now. Just sitting down against a wall, on a curb, on the side of the street, because it's just been a depressing season. But hey, got a little better. Beat the Jets on Monday night. I was excited about that. 14 to 10. And then things go from good, looking good, making this bitter season a little sweeter, although we're not going to the playoffs, and the best record we can hope for is 7-9. Seven and, seven and, and it goes from things looking good and a, a good future for next season, and then we find out, and then, uh, yeah, we get back to reality and we realize we got to play the Packers in Lambeau tomorrow, noon. It's probably going to be like negative 44-degree weather up there in Green Bay around Christmas time, and I'm just hoping we don't give uh, Green Bay an early Christmas present, kind of like we did the Bears at home when we gave up 50. The Bears dropped 50 on us, and we only scored three touchdowns. Yeah, I hope it's not an early Christmas present. I hope it's not like that for the Packers. I hope we don't get let Green Bay and Aaron Rodgers drop 50 on us. But, uh, yeah, here's pretty much the only way we're going to win tomorrow. Of course, I'll always have confidence in my Titans, but here's the only way we're going to win tomorrow. Let's just get things straight. Causing turnovers. That's how we beat Mark Sanchez and the Jets. But then again, this is Aaron Rodgers and the Packers. The Packers are 10-4. and They're 5-0 and in their division. We've got to cause turnovers. We cause turnovers against Mark Sanchez. Why? Because Mark Sanchez sucks. I mean, half the time he's throwing the ball at the ground. But uh, this is Aaron freaking Rodgers, okay? Yeah, Sanchez was pretty good a few years ago, led the Jets to the AFC Championship. They lost there. Haven't done much since. But this is Aaron freaking Rodgers. Won the Super Bowl a couple years ago. Jordan Rodgers' older brother. Yeah. All I got to say is that somehow, some way, we've got to get through and break through Green Bay's O-line get to Rodgers just like the New York Giants did on Sunday Night Football a few weeks, maybe a little over a month ago. They got through Green Bay's own line and hammered Rodgers all night, and they ended up crushing Green Bay in what should have been a good game, but it wasn't because Green Bay's O line absolutely flopped on the ground for the majority of the time. That's what we got to try to uh, get Green Bay's O line to do. Our D, our D line has got to get to – has got to get to Rodgers, and we've got to force turnovers. Of course, it's going to be a tough task against Rodgers because he's more disciplined than Sanchez. It's going to be a tough task just to beat the Packers. But, you know, if we can perform defensive-wise as we did on Monday Night Football and, you know, just try to cause maybe one or two turnovers from Rodgers, next thing you know, you got a ball game. So turnovers are key in this game just like it was against the Jets but it's still Rodgers. So the only way we're going to get Rodgers to throw turnovers and not get on a roll is to pressure him, break through that O-line Titans, just like the Giants did a few weeks ago, a month or two ago on Sunday Night Football. Break through the O-line, pressure Rodgers, make him throw bad passes. And we'll see what we can get going on uh, offense. It'll probably be Chris Johnson running like, Two yard, one yard, negative four yard plays here and then, going, taking two steps forward and one step back. And, you know, just stuff like that. Clay Matthews will probably murder Chris Johnson on about every play. And Green Bay's de defensive line probably murder CJ on about every play. Uh, so, I don't know. All I know is that I hope that we can produce turnovers on Green Bay's offensive side. And. You know, who knows? Maybe you'll see a game tomorrow. Most people aren't expecting that, but you never know. It's any given Sunday, you could say. So it's up in Lambeau. It's going to be cold as, yeah, just cold. Uh, it's Christmas time. Hope everybody has a Merry Christmas. I'll probably make a few more videos. Uh, I'll probably make one tomorrow following my response to the Titans-Packers game, however that works out. Hopefully it's a win for the Titans, but got to produce turnovers. For me to make a video like that about a win. Either way, you never know. Titans could come out and just beat the living you-know-what out of the Packers. So, you never know. Any given Sunday, produce turnovers, Titans. 
Let's knock off Green Bay and Lambeau and send these Packer fans home with a not-so-Merry Christmas. All right, well, that's it. Merry Christmas to everyone. Hope you all have a good Christmas, except for the Packers and Packers fans. You guys are going to get hopefully mauled by the Titans. We'll see if we can produce turnovers. That's all i got to say. Go Doors 55 out. Go Titans.